This is how you scan documents with simple scan on the Raspberry Pi running Raspberry Pi OS. So go to your graphics and then simple scan. And then if this is the first time you're using simple scan, you can adjust some of the settings by clicking on the arrow by the scan button and you can select text or photo. Text is for black and white and photo will be in color. And you can also go down to your documents and preferences to select the quality. So my scanner tops out 600 dpi, so I have selected 600 dpi for both text and photo resolution. It should be noted that your preferences are saved, so if you close simple scan and you relaunch it, your preferences are saved so if i go back to preferences you can see that the quality settings are retained and so are my preference of whether i want it to be colored or uh, black and white so i'm just going to put something in my scanner and i'm going to click on scan so at this point of time you have uh, one of two options you either can continue scanning or you can save you only need to save once you are finished scanning a particular document. So for example, you want to scan a invoice and the invoice is two pages. So instead of, I would now, I would continue scanning by clicking scan. So once you have scanned all the pages you like to scan, now is the time to save. So you can just click on the save button and you can name it whatever you like. I'm going to call it my new file number four. And you can also save it wherever you like. I'm okay with the pre-selected destination, which is desktop. So save. And now, for example, if you like to scan a new document, you can do so by clicking on start again. And we have already saved the current document. So we can just click on discard changes and we can start scanning our new document. Now what happens if you have had continue scanning without starting again? Well, what will happen will be your new document would also have the previous documents uh, scan pages in it, which may not be optimal. So I hope that helps with how the simple scan it's not that complicated and thank you for watching.